Hey, how are you, buddy? How are you? All right. Uh, we'll do the jalapeno whopper, the ch uh, jalapeno crispy chicken. Yep. And there's no other jalapeno things on the menu? No, that, that's only two. That's only two? Yeah. I'll do those two and we'll see which one's better. That's all, right? Yeah. And that'd be 2032 Trump finisher. Thank you. What is your favorite drink, ladies and gentlemen? Let's just give, mm, what would you do? Diet Coke or Coke Zero? Mm. Let's do this one. I don't want to waste it, so I'm just going to do half. He's giving me this for free, which is very nice of him. But has committed no crime. So the uh, jalapeno Whopper came to uh, $8.99 and the chicken is $8.99 with our tax and everything. It was $20 and 30 something cents. Sir, thank you so kindly. Thank Appreciate you. Thank you very much, sir. Have a good day. Eh? You too, man. Did you get the receipt there? I got one. Thank you, Thank sir. you. Bye, guys. Okay. You too. See you again. <laughs> Woohoo! We are back in the car. Ladies and gentlemen, let's go to the trusty steering wheel tray and start eating, shall we? Oh, he gave me bonus fries. Look at all the bonus fries. You know how they're all bonus fries? Cause I didn't ask for them. So I had to go through my, my YouTube page and try to figure out what I haven't had at Burger King. And I, I have not had the jalapeno Whopper and I haven't had this crispy, crispy chicken. I looked up other YouTubers have done the crispy chicken jalapeno thing uh, like five years ago. So I'm really late to the party. We had the special bonus fries in the cardboard packaging thanks to Burger King Bradford. And then at the bottom of the bag, there's even more bonus fries. And uh, I'm not sure if you want to count them. Go ahead. Extra bonus fries. Let's, uh, let's put them there for just a second, then we'll dump them out on the tray. Let's open up this Whopper first. Use the Whopper packaging as our, our plate. Let's do this, let's organize. And he also gave me the, the pop for free. That's why I only took half, because as again, as you guys know, I'm not drinking pop anymore, so. Uh, but he gave me something free, so I thought I'd just give it a shot, see what, see if I can make a, a comment out of it with you guys, saying, you know, what would you prefer? Coke Zero or Diet Coke? So start writing, ooh. We got a cheese pull. Look on this side too. Cheese pull. Should try to get it out of the wrapper like that. Oh my goodness. Wrapper cheese. Oh, I broke it. I broke it open. Okay, now we can dump the extra fries and ketchup. There we go. That's the kind of mess we're looking for right there. All right, guys, going in for the extreme close up of the jalapeno specials here at Burger King Canada. Over here we have the Jalapeno Whopper. Let's pull the lid up a little bit. There we go. We've got our Jalapeno Cream Sauce. We've got pickled jalapenos. We got the Monterey Jack Cheese and then that Whopper Patty Toasted Bun. Fresh test, nice. Over here we've got the Crispy Chicken Jalapeno. Again, shiny bun. Pull this lid up. More jalapeno. Uh, we've got the sauce. We've got the toasted bun. We've got the cheese. And we've got that chicken. I want to roll her over so you guys can see the crispy chicken patty right there. I guess I could have rolled over the Whopper too. Oh, they put sauce on both sides. This is extra special. Then we've got our fries, a couple munchy munchies, and we got our pop. Let's eat. So we had eight and a half bonus fries in the bottom of the bag. Yes, I know they just fell out of the carton. Try to have fun, people. Try to have fun. Nice and crispy, salty, 
yummy. Just what to expect at Burger King. Very nice. More ketchup to store up for later. Okay, I don't think I've had a Coke Zero in many, many years. Still don't like it. Okay. <laughs> I just, oh my gosh, what an awful taste. I think I've tried it many times in the past. Disgusting. Okay, let's put our fries over there. I'd rather drink straight Coke, especially the Coke from uh, Mexico because it's got that sugar cane um, sweetness to it. All right, guys, going in for the Whopper, jalapeno Whopper. Cheers. You're getting that tanginess from the pickled uh, jalapenos. You're getting those great flavors of a Whopper. The sauce is nice too and, and spicy. It's definitely heating up slowly in my mouth. Ooh la la. I love the cheese. It'd be nice to double the cheese up. I was thinking I could make a new concoction. Put bacon on it and the crispy chicken on top of this and make one crazy sandwich. I think we might just do that by the end of this thing. I should have ordered a couple extra slices of bacon just in preparation. Okay, here we go. Crispy chicken jalapeno style. I'm gonna go for this long tongue part. Tongue in your mouth. Ooh la la. Mmm. Crunchy chicken. I think that was the first time I got French kissed by Burger King Canada. And I've never had that same experience with any other place. Only Burger King Canada. This is oozing out. The sauce is really nice. The only thing that would make that better is fresh jalapeno over the um, pickled one because the pickle has that, you know, tangy, uh, you know, pickle juice flavor to it, you know. As a lot of you guys remember, I used to hate pickles. Now, I like pickles now, but uh, you know, pickled jalapenos are okay as well. But I think fresh jalapeno on here would just make this completely different and taste way better. So they're both the same price. So you're not going to save any money. Ooh, that sauce is starting to heat up. Woo! I'm going to flip this over because I think the most sauce was on the bottom of the, the burger. Let me just do a quick lick. That's almost like they have, um, well, they probably definitely have like a, they pour jalapeno pickled brine sauce into this sauce so it's like a mayo with pi uh, pickled jalapeno sauce in it or they ground up pickled jalapenos and put that in the sauce because you're getting that again tanginess of the pickled jalapenos and the tanginess of the sauce which I think was made with pickled jalapenos as well and then the Monterey Jack is at least kind of offset in that tanginess I actually think there's more food on the chicken than the beef. Uh, it just felt, as I picked it up, it just felt like a heavier sandwich. So I'm guessing that there's probably more meat. Uh, I'll have to check the website when I'm editing. But let's do another uh, comparison back to back.
way better way better than that every time I try something new at Burger King and I don't like it that much I always remind Burger King that their Whopper is one of my favorite fast food burgers on the planet so you have nothing to worry about there and it's always nice that you guys try new things and I think I've tried a couple of your uh, spicy things in the past uh, with my buddy Paul I think it was the last video that we did and it was the ghost pepper uh, Whopper oh my nozzles turned off so I'm gonna have to give the jalapeno Whopper an indifferent rating and uh, this is definitely going to be a would recommend I would recommend that to anybody who likes jalapenos who likes a bit a little bit of spice in their life I'm gonna take a little bit of a bite off this side because that thing's really good let's do the mashup now like I said I would we got extra cheese extra jalapeno extra sauce put that on there there we go that's cooking there Burger King Canada put that on the menu but bacon you gotta put bacon on there as well and maybe like a, I don't know a jalapeno candy bacon just an idea if you do it you know I get residuals just kidding here we go Woo! That was good. That's a good bite. I can barely get my mouth around it. Ooh la la. Another angle to consider is it's just very vinegary flavored uh, tasting. You know, if you put too much vinegar on your fries or your onion rings or your fish and you eat that one bite with too much vinegar on it, you go, <coughs> that's what that tastes like. I'm a I'm a big advocate for extra sauce, but when it's like this vinegary, again you've got the the jalapeno tanginess, you got a lot of sauce tanginess on it, and I just kind of doubled everything up, so it is extra 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 saucy. Mmm, extra saucy. If you're gonna be hungry in the next couple days, you want to head over to Burger King. Uh, do this combination. But I definitely suggest adding bacon to this. Make sure you get the double cheese, the beef patty, the crispy chicken, jalapenos, sauce, 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 or maybe just sauce, sauce. And again, not too much sauce because it gets really wacky. Um, but that's good. You're getting the best of both worlds in there. And I'm not sure how much that would cost you. I'm not sure how much things cost when you break them up like that. But give it a shot. I did, and it's yummy. I almost forgot to rate the Coke Zero, and that would be a would not recommend. Yuck. All right, guys, we are all done here at Burger King. I'd like to thank Burger King Bradford for accommodating me. So thanks for the bonus fries and the uh, free drink. Although I'll never buy Coke Zero again. I'd like to take this moment and thank every single one of you guys for watching my videos, clicking that thumbs up, leaving those comments, sharing my videos, adding this video to your favorites list. Thank you. I also like to thank all my channel members for all your monthly support and my supporters over on Patreon. You guys rock. But if you enjoyed this video and you want to show your support for me doing these videos just for you, hit it with a thumbs up, ding, 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 ding. But if you're still hungry for more, check out that place I put down over there. And we'll see you over there. Bring your hunger.